um, I'm afraid that um, we're pretty much, pretty much there in terms of time. So what we're going to do is we're going to play uh, again a uh, medley of a couple of songs that I wrote for my band. And um, basically, we talked about the metric modulation. There was a question about that. Uh, what you're going to hear in uh, the statement of this uh, melody, the, yeah, the way Yannick is going to play it, we're going to go between like a straight 5-4 and then a funky sounding beat that seems like it's in 4. But what's actually happening, it's a division of 16 notes that's not um, on the beat. Uh, so I'm using 5 16 notes as the basis for the new groove. So here it is. Um, tighten this up a little bit. Basically what I'm talking about is you have 16 notes in 5 4. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. But then you can divide those 16 notes any which way. So um, for example, instead of playing 5 times 4, you can play 4 times 5 16 notes. So nothing changes, the time stays the same, but your accents are going to fall differently. So then if I take out all the 16 notes and leave the accents, you see that the accents are going at a slower rate than the hi-hat, which is doing the beats. Then, if, you, if I take the first and the third accent and play them on the bass drum, I get a sort of a new, funky, bad bass drum backbeat kind of a thing over this 5-4 groove. And if I put eighth notes to this new pulse, two completely concurrent yet different things going um, going on on the same track. So uh, now after I've explained it, we're going to do this and I think this is going to be pretty much it for us. So I think I said everything. Uh, I've thanked everybody. I want to thank you guys again for coming out and, and checking us out. I want to thank Yannick Guzdala for being such a great bass player. This is a medley of two compositions for my band Sveti. Uh, one is uh, entitled 5-4, and the other one is entitled 5-0. And uh, that's it. Thank you very much.
Thank you.